your latest news update from Western Mass News. I'm Matt Satilli and here's your latest news update from Western Mass News. A fire last week forced a preschool in Agawam to temporarily close. Now the organization Crayon Project is collecting donations to put together care packages for the students affected. These care packages will contain art supplies and will be sent to the school by the end of the week. The Junior League of Greater Springfield held their first ever favorite read 5K run today. Runners dressed up as their favorite book characters as the nonprofit celebrates their centennial year. It's a play on the organization's Little Red Bookshelf program, which aims at providing free books for families in Springfield. Each participant was able to go home with a book and all proceeds will benefit the community. Nick's Nest, Holyoke's world famous hot dog spot, celebrated over 100 years of business and 17 years under their current ownership. We stopped by where we caught up with one of the owners, Jennifer Shatinoff. She tells us celebrating this anniversary feels really good, especially after so many small businesses were forced to shut down due to the pandemic. She adds they're looking forward to the next 17 years. Well, it wasn't the sunniest of Sundays out there, but the silver lining, it was mostly dry, unlike the last several days, 47. Yet yeah, temperatures were in the mid to upper 40, so on the chilly side, some showers could be passing on by throughout the evening hours, but they should weaken. And our slice of heaven is right here. This is for the start of the week. Many of you are off this week for spring break. For those that are in school, it is also Holy Week. Today is Palm Sunday. And overall, this the week of Holy Week starts off on a beautiful note with temperatures. Yeah, wait till you see how warm it gets by late in the week. Right now, on the chilly side, 40s and 50s. That was it. And then clearing skies, like I mentioned, and really a slice of beautiful weather to start off the week. Cannot get better than that with highs likely around or even above 60. The warming pattern comes Tuesday right through most of the week. Unfortunately, there's also some showers, so 62 to maybe 72 or 73 if we have enough sun late in the week. And unfortunately, like I mentioned, we're going to be a little bit cloudier with the chance for some showers towards the seven-day forecast. You're going to see that right there. Late week, good Friday on Friday, Easter Sunday on Sunday. Could be some showers, no washouts likely, but we'll watch the forecast closely. Stay with Western Mass News on air, online, and on our app throughout the day for breaking news, weather, and exclusive content.